Okay, Bill, Bill and Nicole, uh, great to see you here at JNS Accessories at Oakmere again. And um, this year you've had a bit of an up and down year, you know, with, with a few health issues and whatever else. But you came back uh, fighting on the super stock bike at Thruxton. And then latterly, uh, Cadwell Park, you had a fantastic outing on the super bike. Um, Alton Park this weekend, obviously it's our, our home circuit and we, we love it there. How do you think you're going to go this weekend, Bill? Yeah, you know, it's a, it's been a tough battle. Um, you know, we started off, we finished second last year in the championship, and uh, we really wanted to um, try to win the championship. We lost out because we had a few little tyre issues last year, and um, you know, it sort of cost us in the end. So we we really um, was looking to go and fight the championship, you know, and unfortunately I had a um, had a stomach operation, had an abscess in my stomach, which had a perforated appendix, and it was a massive mess in there. So we had a yeah. drain pipe in there for nine weeks. So we missed about four rounds. So. Uh, to, to think about coming back and riding after that injury was um, something uh, different and then when I actually did come back and ride it felt like I haven't been off the bike and um, it was a big relief just in uh, something that you keep picturing and you want to, to do and achieve and then when you actually get to finally do it and just be back in the paddock and back speaking to you guys and you know back with the big family that is motorcycle racing it was, was awesome. Good, good. Um, well listen it's always good to see you back and we you know we know you're the people's favourite that you know everybody likes you. Um, one thing we've done, we've, we've asked a few of our customers some questions, they've sent some questions in who can ask you. Um, what was your inspiration? I mean, I know you're from Australia, it's a long way from home, and you, you, what's your inspiration to ride in the UK? Um, it, was always a, it was always to be a stepping stone into World Superbike. I've actually seen a lot of people come from Australia to British Superbike, and then, or Supersport even, and into the to the world stage, you know, we had um, Chris Van Mullen, um, but the biggest one was Glenn Richards and Paul Young. They're good friends with my dad, and they were every racing. And their yeah. manager, Mickey G, Mick Granger, called us up when we were in Australia. He got us over here, and then uh, once I come over here and met everyone, and it's hard to go back. You know, England's my mum's British. Um, she, I didn't know that. Bill. Yeah, yeah. Well, there you are. There's another one. So, yeah, she was uh, one of the ten pound pumps. So, um, she well, she went to Australia when she was nine, but right. I've got two passports, so I can come and go. So that's it works perfectly with my racing because it's very hard with some of the races to sure. get the work visas. But sure. England is definitely my second home now. I said if the weather was as good as Spain or like Australia, I'd probably never leave. But right. when it starts coming in those darker nights and the, and the cold starts coming, mate, it's, it's time sure. to go back. But okay. yeah, England's a beautiful championship, and it's uh, you know it took us two hours to get here today and everywhere. I'm in the Midlands, everywhere is two hours. In Australia, my second closest track is ten and a half hours, so right. that starts to get to you a bit. Okay, good. Um, and finally, Billy, um, the kit, GNS accessories have helped you for the previous two years, certainly with the Frank Thomas DS suit. Um, I know last year you had a, a couple of small spills, which weren't too major, uh, but in terms of the kit that GNS accessories provide, uh, could you just give us an insight to well, you only where got, you're at really? you only got to have a look at the kit, mate. It's worth about three seconds as soon as you pull it out of the bag. It just looks smart. You know, the team are really happy with it. The colours are awesome. The kit's um, comfortable. It's it's so supple. When you're standing up and uh, walking through the pits or just going down the paddock, it feels uncomfortable. As soon as you got into that riding right. position, which right. it's made for, it's, um, it's head and shoulders above the rest. I love being in the Jazz accessory stuff, the airbag stuff. The first time it deployed, uh, was a little bit scary because like, I thought I actually popped my shoulders out because I couldn't That's move right. my shoulders. Well, but, I, I recall but, that because yeah. that was your first accident after and your big accident. And, once, and then you get and then you roll through it all and you and you wake up with uh, well, you get around with no scabs on you. You know you can't sort of fault the airbag system and, and the actual quality of the of the leather. Superb. Well, listen, Billy, have a fantastic weekend. Thank you very Cheers, much. Thanks for your support.